Welcome to our Express Microsoft Edge tutorials. We've designed these lessons to cover a single topic as quickly and as efficiently as possible. Today's lesson, we're going to show you how to save your home page or multiple home pages so you have what you want displayed every time you open Microsoft Edge. Okay, so when you first get Windows 10, this is going to be your start page on Microsoft Edge and we want a different home page every time we open Edge. So we're gonna go over here where these little round circles are. You're gonna click on that and slide down to Settings. Click the radio button for a specific page or pages. And where it says MSN, you're gonna click on that box and drop down to Custom. We're gonna hit the box that says Remove, the X to the right. And we're going to enter our new web address. We're going to use yahoo.com. Go over to the right side and click the add or the plus sign. As you can see, it's displayed now above the enter the web address box. We're going to close our window. Go down and reopen Edge. And as you can see, Yahoo is now your home page. So every time you open Microsoft Edge, Yahoo will come up. But let's say you wanted multiple pages. Now, when you're browsing, you can just hit the Add New Tab up here, but that's not going to save your new tab. We need to go back to the three circles on the right side, click there, go back down to Settings. You already have the radio button set for a specific page, and it's already set on Custom. We're just going to add another web address here. Let's choose CNN.com. And you can choose any web address that you want. This is strictly made so you can customize Edge. Click the Add button. As you can see, now we have two. We're going to add one more because in the mornings we usually scroll through multiple things. We'll add msn.com. Hit the plus button. Now we have three. We'll go up here, close Microsoft Edge, go down and reopen it. And as you can see, we now have three tabs opening up. Keep in mind that the more tabs that you have that open and the more complex those pages are, the longer it will take Edge to open. Thanks for watching our video. Be sure to click the like button below and subscribe to our channel for new computer tutorials as they become available. Feel free to comment below about this video or ask a question. Until next time, enjoy surfing the net.